In the previous video, we talked about process stage and how to work with multiple process. Now, in this video, we will talk about how to pass value from one process to another process. We have two process, one that is the first underscore process and second that we have subtract. Let me open both side by side. So this is subtract and this is the child process and this is the master process. I have called the child process in the master process. Now currently what is happening here we have number one and number two right and we are passing default value here but now in this scenario I don't want to pass default value I want to take input from this process this is another process right so as you know that we have startup parameters start stage where we can add parameters input parameters and we can take value so what I'm going to do here I'm going to double click on the start and this is the child process subtract and now add and right here number one number one for subtract and this will be number and whatever value we'll get will store in the number one now same here we'll take number two number two for number and then we'll store in the number two now click ok now just delete this and delete this also and let me first save that the startup parameter add it right now save this and now just go to this double click on this and you can see now we have number one and number two so now I'm going to pass value this one I will take input from value one and number two that will be value two now click OK so what will happen by this way we will pass this value to this child process and after processing this once subtraction performed here then whatever value will be showing in this subtract I want to pass to the this main process double click on and you know that from this end stage we can send our output to the main main process or to the master process so add and here I want to write result subtract and then in the description uh, in the type we can take number and we'll take value from subtract so whatever output will show in the subtract that will be passed to this page now just save this so and parameter setup setup right save changes close this now if we we'll double click on the subtract process and in the output you can see now we have result subtract and now we can store that value again in the result that is we have the existing data item click ok now just change value I am going to write here 15 and then this is 13 ok reset this now step by step it will go add this 28 so currently for the addition we have 28 right we can see this addition value on the main process now step by step again it will go to the subtraction process and you can see 15 minus 13 we have now answer that is 2 once it will go from this and stage and you will see here now we have value result 2 on the first process that is our master process so by this way we can take value from master process into the child process and we can send our result value or output value from the child process to master process. I hope you like this video.